We also have an update now to that story here in central Indiana, a fight at George Washington High School. Yeah, this was our breaking news last night at five o'clock. That fight shut down a portion of Washington Street, and tonight we've learned someone brought a gun and that person was not a student. Rich and I now reports on that armed adult who was arrested at the school. About this time Wednesday afternoon, Washington Street was blocked off in both directions in front of George Washington Community High School. IPS police called in Metro Police to respond to a fight. But IPS is not explaining why a 40 year old woman with a loaded semi automatic rifle was arrested on school property. 37 police officers are listed as responding to what IPS calls multiple altercations at Washington High School Wednesday about 2 p.m. around school dismissal time. The police report says three juveniles, a 16-year-old girl, a 15-year-old boy, and a 14-year-old boy were arrested for battery. 40-year-old Cheryl Harris was also arrested with a kel Sub-2000 semi-automatic rifle like this one. Police say the weapon was loaded with an extended Glock magazine. Harris was taken into custody for pointing a loaded firearm possession of a loaded firearm on school property, and intimidation with a deadly weapon. Jail records say she is also held for carrying a handgun without a license. Metro Police referred questions to IPS, which issued a statement saying the incident was under investigation and that all altercations are being handled under our district's student code of conduct policy. The safety of our students is always our top priority. The police report lists three victims, a female and two males, but no ages. But IPS would offer no details on if the adult woman was a parent or is otherwise connected to students. Police collected the gun, ammunition, and a can of mace as evidence. At last check, Harris was still being held at the Marion County Jail. She has yet to be formally charged. Half